The Ryan Report. We have just received word that it's time for the Ryan Report on Atlanta's big station, V103. It is your free money station and your Ryan Report. All right. You go to uh, YouTube and you try to get to teach me how to Dougie after the uh, murder that we talked about. But who's got all these views in two days? None other than Chris Breezy. Chris Brown mm-hmm. doing the Dougie at some nightclub. Yeah. So how does he get all of these views when people should be looking at the original? Yeah, well, because, you know, Inbone, they try to describe Cali Swag District. They're the ones from Teach Me How to Dougie. So right. I guess people, since he died, the interest has been, oh, which one is he rapping in Cali Swag District? The problem is is that instead of going to their actual video, everyone keeps going to the Chris Brown video. Mm. So he has over 13 and a half million hits since M. Bone's murder two days ago. Wow. This video's been up for a couple years. I mean, it's been up for over a year. It's been up for a while. Well, we got some other news. Yeah. Some other videos that are about to break some records. Yeah. I know you're saying to yourself, when is this Run the World video going to premiere? Am I? It's going to happen, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> on BET Uncut. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I just want to see you mess with you. I just mess with you. I just mess with you. I just mess with you. No, really, it's going to be on American Idol. Okay, that's fair. During the top three performance episode Wednesday night. It's supposed to happen on Vivo last Friday, but now they will do a clip from the unveiled video tomorrow night on Idol. Beyonce has already released a teaser, but you will see the whole entire video. Not some bad marketing. American People Idol? watching American right. Idol, there you go. Absolutely. It's a big part of why Jenny from the Black song went really, really big. My thing is, um, I haven't seen a snippet of the video. I know it's going to be fierce because it's B, but I'm really praying she's not doing the two other girl thing. I'm really praying she's not doing the trio of girls things that she did for every single video last last album. I want to do something totally new, something we've never seen before. I would like to see her crawling around in pumps. Oh, okay. That'd I be different. I think that's something nobody's ever seen. No, you're right. She's yeah. never done that before. Maybe even, I don't know, Dare a she? leotard or something. You think so? Something we've never seen. Dare she? And shake it really hard. That'd be Beyonce crazy. says the billboard is definitely riskier than something a bit more simple. I just heard the track and loved that it was so different. It felt a bit African, a bit electronic, and futuristic. It reminded me of what I love, which is mixing different cultures and eras, things that typically don't go together, to create a new sound. I could never be safe. I always try and go against the grain. As soon as I accomplish one thing, I just set a higher goal. That's how I've gotten to where I am. It's my motivation. Speaking of which, I was going to say, speaking of which, make sure to cop my girl's song. Okay. Showtime at Apollo is coming back with Jamie Foxx. Amateur Night is back, produced by Jamie Foxx. Uh, and it's been a long time since somebody has been discovered on Showtime at the Apollo. Yeah. Fox, of course, booed off as a comedian back in the day. But they will continue the same vein with the Apollo Theater Amateur Night. So get ready because it's going back, but it's coming back on BET. Is it? Right. You think they're going to do the the kids and stuff? I'm going to be honest. When I was younger, I hated the kids part. because they Apollo had to kids? Be, yeah, because they had to be nice and no one could boo. And yeah. I was like, the fun part of Apollo was just seeing if everyone's going to trash them. And everybody, these are just babies. Please hold your boos. Please. It was just, it was boring. Well, of course, they will have the traditional Sandman. Guess who will be the new Sandman? Who? Aretha Franklin. <laughs> Aretha's busy lately. She's doing a lot. They done filming out here? The Stooges, she the is Sandman. really doing some big stuff. Unbelievable. All right. <laughs> <laughs> and that is your Ryan Report. Where right now, if you want to go and see the uh, 14th Annual BMI Unsigned Urban Showcase tomorrow night with Sean Garrett, Ace Hood, Travis Porter, and Rick Ross, be caller 103 right now, 741-WVEE. And you know it's going to be the best news you've seen in your life. This hour brought to you by Fox 5 News at 10. For the day's biggest stories, breaking news, and your latest forecast, depend on Fox 5 News at 10 with Russ Spencer. And the day is looking sexy. And if you don't know, now you know, you know, you know, you know.